decision. How did that feel in there? Uh, good to be sharp. So I basically got a hard fight physical, but it's a good chest battle. It was really good to be sharp. We're saying on the commentary there, a really cagey affair. Uh, it felt like one or two moments were really going to be decisive in there. I, I didn't know about it. If I'm jumping in and he catches me, that's me putting catch up for round one. So I didn't know about get caught with something big early and that's me in the Asked me in the front foot, but just I said my dad and Ricky and Ian, um, Robbie and Ian and just stuck to the game plan that worked. You had a big final third round, it looks like you won that one clear. Were you confident you'd done enough over the first couple of rounds? He landed a couple of shots in the first two, but it wasn't anything like he came forward. He was just skiffing his when I was coming in. So I, I thought, I thought I'd win the first two. And then the last round, I just, he started to open up. I, I thought he thought he was behind, so, so he started coming forward. And, just catch them, catch them. That was your first international contest of this year. Are you hoping for a, a big 2023? Of course, I want everything. And also, I get a big thanks to my sponsors, Conley Sport. Um, I forgot. Conley Sport, Ernock Builders, and the Daimler Foundation. They do they, they everything for this man. I appreciate them so much. And how was it having your dad in the corner there? Good. I've asked him for the time he's been my corner on international duty. And my dad's been there, he's done it all, I'm not going to disagree with him in the corner, I like what he says to me and it worked. Well, well done tonight, Julian, look forward to seeing more of you in the future. Thank you, cheers.